What's going on, Clay Timers? Today, live on Clay Time, we're going to talk about warming up urine in the microwave. If you're watching on YouTube, we're going to be here, like I said, every day on Face or Face <laughs> FaceTime on Facebook Live, uh, Monday through Friday at 5:30. Check out the show every day. You can go ahead and check out the replay replay of the show. Let's get to it. I'll show you everything you need to know. Welcome to Clay Time in Basement Podcast Show, a show like no other. Wild over the top opinions from an angry, cigar smoking, living in the basement of a house he pays on, road comic father who is technically married and understandably frustrated. Here he is, Clay Miles. What's going on, everybody? How you doing? Like I said, if you're watching on YouTube, subscribe. Subscribe, subscribe. Go ahead and see this is this ignorance every day. Every day we're gonna have this ignorance going. So please subscribe and check out and see what's going on. We'll come up with something new every day because you know why there is so many ignorant people in the world. What's up, Will? How you doing, baby? All right, this is my boy Will from the bro the Brost. I love that. The Bros Podcast. I love it. All right. What's up, bruh? All right, let me go ahead and promote my other, my other family out there. Of course, you, of course, you got the Bros Podcast. He's going to be up here pretty soon. I'll have to redo this. But uh, thanks a lot there, Will. I appreciate it. <laughs> but anyway, nice. This is Damaged Goods Inc. Dot com. Now, this is everybody who's a part of the network. You got Damaged Goods, the people who started everything, Daddy Issues, Clay Time in the Basement, Boom, Baked and Wait, Beta Testing, Needless to Say. Check out all these uh, podcasts on this network right here on this website. We're going to get another one on there called The Bros coming pretty soon whenever he decides to come on over. We're trying to take over the world, baby. Boom. And get my shirt. We actually had a couple people, couple people actually, uh, my family, from the guy needless to motherfucking say, got the shirt. Chillin', chillin', chillin'. So, uh, you wanna get the shirt? It's cafepress.com forward slash clay time in the basement. Thank you. Bam! The other shirt, the shirt I sell at the shows, you guys can check this out. It's cafepress.com forward slash Stand up comic Clay Miles, the outlaw shirt. So check that out. It's one word. Stand up comic Clay Miles. One word. And of course, I have to promote Bam, my show. And I don't know if you guys seen the links. I don't know if it's a, above or below. On YouTube, it's probably below. But I got my links. If you want to come out to the show, we still got some tickets left. But they are going fast, so you can go ahead and get them quick. October 13th, Club Heaven and Hell this Saturday. Bam! CD recording, and I will tell you where, when it will be available on YouTube, will be on Amazon, and uh, you can buy it directly from me, hard copy, boom, hard, okay, anyway. What's up, family, how you doing, Will, what's up, baby? Thanks for coming out again, Will, I appreciate it. I start doing this ignorance every day. I was doing it for an hour, Will. I was doing it for an hour before, and I was getting, you know, some, some, I was getting hot. People were watching. I was getting hot. But I realized, wait a minute. I want people to see this every day. You know, I want people to watch the replay. And if I do an hour, you know what I mean? Nobody's going to sit there for an hour. What the fuck? What the fuck? I mean, seriously. I wouldn't sit there. I can't, I can't even listen to myself for 15 minutes. I don't know how y'all do it. But I love y'all for doing it. Well, my dogs are fucking with the doors out there. All right, let's get right to it. I got to get... All right, now this first one coming up is a person who actually warmed pee in the microwave. I I, I didn't even get to see this yet. I gotta, I'm got watching it with you. A Jacksonville, a Jacksonville gas, gas station, station owner says he's sick, sick and tired of people warming, warming up urine, urine in his, his microwave. microwave. Turns, Turns out, out the store... The store hold on, time out, time out, time out, time out, time out. Sick and tired, I, and, and and it's our dude. It's the dude who does not know how. To, how are you sick and tired about people warming up urine in your microwave? 
Because you let them do it. How, how can you be sick and tired of something you're letting them fucking do? That doesn't even work. Sick and th I'm sick and tired of them sticking this dick in my ass. No, just, just close your booty. I don't know what to tell you. What the fuck? Close the store. If they walk into the store with urine, you got to get the fuck out. How are they getting into the store with urine? Hey, I just happened to have this cup that isn't a cup from your store. What type of nasty little motherfuckers are, are okay, all right, let, let's see the rest of it. First, within walking, walking distance, distance two, two labs that offer drug, drug testing services and urine samples, samples turned in must be at a certain temperature, temperature so it seems so like people are trying, trying to pass their, their test, test maybe a little cheating. cheating. What the fuck? Oh, hold on, hold on, we got to, I, I talked too much. I got, we got to go back and see exactly what this is about. Warming up urine, urine in his microwave. microwave. It turns, turns out the store is within walking, walking distance of two labs that offer drug, drug testing, testing services and urine, urine samples. Turned in, in must, must be at a certain, certain temperature, temperature, so it seems, so it seems like people, people are trying, trying to pass their, their test, test maybe a little cheating. Parole, Parole put put You think? You think a little cheating, motherfucker? And you didn't explain to me how warming up your pee will help you pass your test. Not that I'm trying to find out some information about how to pass the test, but does warming up your, there's, there's your question, family, right below on YouTube, answer this question, does warming up your pee somehow help you pass the test, see, I never have a question, never have any, anything action for y'all to do, there's your question, what, write it down, must be, what's this, must be a probation officer somewhere, so you understand, Will, is it, so this is something you can, you can, like, warm up your pee, Oh, what's up, baby? What's up, Liam? Damn it, why, why did I find this right before I go to work? Hey, Liam, we're only doing it for 15 minutes, baby, every day, 15 minutes. I'm doing it every day, baby, boom. They verify the temperature the rest of the time, the rest of the test. Okay, all right, I'm not sure. Well, yeah, see, now this is what I was waiting for. Here it is. Sure, it makes it more drinkable. You nasty motherfucker. I wish I had thought of that, Liam. Damn it. Damn it, he's coming on again, just taking over the goddamn show. <laughs> Telltale's first coast news, the last straw was when a woman became aggressive after she was told to stop and asked to see a sign that says you can't do this here. So Whoa! There's also not a sign that says you can't rub your pussy all over everything. Do we have to have signs for everything, people? Oh, There's no sign that says I can't warm my pee up. In the microwave? Oh, really? Okay, so I can go in your house and go go ahead and shit in your microwave and boop. What? Why are you mad at me? I'm cooking shit. No. Oh, if you didn't want anybody to cook shit in your microwave, where's the sign? Where's the sign that says I can't cook shit in this microwave? Like I said, you are wrong. Oh, I, we that stupid as people. He, he made a sign. sign. I feel, I feel like, like you wouldn't, wouldn't have, have to do, do that, that, but alas. alas. Met met your your CBS CBS Miami. Miami. He fucking made a sign. This is how fucking stupid we become as people. I'm sorry, we have actually hit rock fucking bottom. He made a fucking sign that said, hey, could you not warm your pee up in, in my microwave? People have to eat in there. Oh, people eat in that microwave. My, If I knew you were using it to have people eat out of, I wouldn't be putting my piss in there. Thank you for the sign. What the fuck? Okay, this next one. You're going to load this next one. Uh, all right, Liam, here you go. This next one is a good Samaritan. I can say that. He's a good Samaritan. Let's just go ahead and get to it. Fuck, where is it at? Good Samaritan. I, you see what I'm talking about? This, this is the shit I'm talking about. My producer is fired. I, he's fired. This is bullshit. You're fired. Uh, who am I yelling at? I'm, I'm talking to myself. All right, anyway. This next one uh, is a walking poop. Walk in poop. Now, they've made, uh, and, and it's so great who actually did this. This is Fox News. <laughs> okay, I just play it. I just, I just got to play it. So we got another new big guy exhibiting in the Netherlands. The New York Times reported this, and here's what they said. Modern, well, I'm saying, modern art is what it represents in this case. You are looking at enormous turd skull excrement. No, fuck you, excrement. He said it right. It's a big-ass turd. Look at that.
What dinosaur let that shit go out? Why are you late to work, Liam? Oh, I was just watching a man in a basement. <laughs> <laughs> Liam, I only got five more minutes, baby. I only got five more minutes. <laughs> You're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. We gotta get, we gotta get through this shit. <laughs> That was good. Hold on. Hold on a second. Hold on. I got to pat myself on the back. We got to get through this shit, Liam. Let me explain to you guys something. Honestly, this is in intrigues me because there's been shit that is that has come out of my body that I thought I could sell. I'm not gonna lie to you. I've always thought I was the Leonardo da Vinci, the you know the sh the Shitsky. Of, of, of the, uh, shit art world. I didn't even know it was, I mean, if you guys could see the angles that I'd be shitting, and I actually get the, you know what I mean? I, I've been putting a curve on that motherfucker. I mean, I can write my name with shit. This is, this is news, okay? Fox News is finally coming out with some news. I mean, that I can watch, cause I mean, <laughs> Exactly, Will. Exactly. Literally. Yes. Fox News is finally giving it to me. Thank you, Fox News, for some real news. <laughs> a real Vogue. <laughs> yeah. Real Van Gogh. Take a shit. Yeah. That's who I am. Yeah. Van Gogh, take a shit. <laughs> Let me explain to you something, guys. If you could sit there on TV and get paid to talk about taking a shit, you can't tell me that this is not a great fucking country that we live in. Are you kidding me? These two got to look at each other and laugh about the money that they are stealing. Every time they get their check, they should have to, they should collect their check with a, with a mask on because they're stealing. Are you kidding me? I'm doing this shit for free. Okay. I'm in the game. I'm in the game for free. I talk about shit. These guys got to get on national TV and talk about shit and take your money. I love you. They don't love you. This is bullshit. Oh, bullshit. That's another artist. <laughs> Yeah, life is a big turd. It ain't a box of chocolates, motherfucker. I mean, what the fuck is your problem? But life, so what you're saying is life is a big turd? Do you? I live in this basement. Yes, life is a big fucking turd. Like, and it, it looks, looks like, like your big dog, Jimmy, walked in. They're on Persian rugs. Oh, hell no! Hold on a sec. This is bullshit. The shit. Has Persian rugs? The shit has Persian rugs? Are you listening to me? The shit has Persian rugs, okay? They're, this person is shitting. Whoever this is, this, this fucking giant. You guys don't believe we don't have giants? Look at that shit. That shit's next to the roof, baby, okay? We have giants. Nobody knows my pain. Nobody knows my pain. Stop the hammering. Stop the hammering out there. Who's got a hammer? Where is it? I don't know. It's on Where's the hammer? It's on a is it on the? Uh, go up on the other floor. Somebody go up there and stop the hammering. <laughs> Fuck you, Liam. Liam says that shit has a better living condition than you, Clay. Fuck! I didn't even think of that. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> You're fucking right, Liam. God damn it. You're right. That's fucking funny. God damn it. Oh, family. All right. Well, I got to get out of here. Like I said, I'm only doing 15 minutes. But let me go ahead and end this really quick. Go ahead. My website or the website to check out all the uh, shows, DamagedGoodsInc.com. Uh, you got Damaged Goods, Daddy Issues, Clay Time in the Basement, Baked and Waked, Needless to Say, The Merch. Get the merch at uh, cafepress.com forward slash clay time in the basement. Of course, you can get the outlaw shirt. Check that out too at cafepress.com forward slash clay time in the no 
stand-up comic Clay Miles. Cafepress.com forward slash stand-up comic Clay Miles. I am a stupid ass. What's this? A shit, the shit flew in on carpets. <laughs> it's, it's a magical carpet ride. Why does it stink? So, reminder, show on the 13th. As you guys saw, I have my links. Check out my links if you want to go ahead and give me a couple dollars. If you want to give me a couple dollars for the show so I can keep on expanding and doing more things with the show, please let me know. If you like this 15-minute uh, uh, really quick pow cast, let me know. Send, them, send me some messages. I can go back and do it in an hour, or you can get little little bit of clay every day. Little bit of clay every day. That sounds like some gay shit. But anyway, I got to get out of here. I love you guys. If you're on YouTube, please, please like, share, um, subscribe. Hit that little, uh, what do you call that? That little, what do you call button? Bing, bing, to go ahead and uh, know when I'm going to be going on. So putting out some new stuff. And I love you guys, and I'll see you tomorrow. I'm out. So now it's time to put out your cigars, walk back in your homes, put those destructive opinions back in your emotional lockboxes, and put your politically correct mask back on. Plausible denial is recommended, and good alibis are suggested. If called upon to testify in a confessional hearing, I don't know you, and you don't know me. If walking those fine lines appeals to you, find him on Twitter, at Clay T Basement, and Facebook page, Playtime in Basement Podcast Show. Thanks for listening. Go take a bath. You need to wash this off.